In this session, we will learn how to handle conflicts when we are trying to commit a particular file or when we are pulling the code from GitHub repository. Currently, I have a sample project called sample-git-project and what I'm going to do, I'm going to simulate the conflict scenario with making some changes in some files. So if I have a look at this project structure, I have multiple branches and the master branch is selected. So let me make some changes over here. I have one field called address. I'll change it to city and this is my employee.java. Now I want to commit this change into remote repository but to simulate the conflict, I need to make some changes in this particular file in the remote repository itself. So from browser, let me go to this particular project. So this is the sample git project in GitHub. And I have three branches. So this master branch, let me click over here. This is selected. Let me go to the employee file. Employee.java and edit this i'm just editing this particular line this comment let me change from sample change one two three to one two four enter a commit message click commit changes so it is committed over here let me try to commit this particular change right click team commit enter a commit message click on commit and push ideally it should prevent because there is already one change made in the remote repository in employee.java and without taking that change we are trying to commit this so let's see what happens as you can see over here this message is this push is rejected now what to do let's click ok so the thing that we can do is to pull all the changes from the repository and try to resolve this particular issue now let me click this project right click team click on pull So as you can see over here, there is conflict as expected because of the merge inputs like I have changed address to city and I have made commit from browser. So these two changes are causing the conflict. So click over here and you can see this particular file that has the conflict. It's marked in red and the file is already opened and this is showing where we have the conflict so from line 8 to 12 this entire part is having the conflict so this is the start and this is the end we had address and now it's city so we need to make the changes let me change the file to handle this particular conflict i'm removing this part and this one as well so it is now updated Control S, save. Now we need to commit this particular file for that. From here we can add it to state changes by dragging this or add to index. So the comment is already populated over there. Like this is the merge. Let me click commit and push. So let me click OK. Now let me go back to the browser in GitHub and see what is the state of my changes. I have refreshed the page. So over here you can see the changes that I have made directly from the browser. It's there and also the changes that I have made from the editor is also there. So we have resolved the conflict that was occurring when we were trying to commit the file and also when we pulled the code from the remote github we had this conflict and we were able to successfully resolve the issue